Urban Dictionary. Dason, what is a Roman helmet in your, in your guess? We're gonna My guess, guess is it's a helmet that doesn't latch tight, so it moves all over the place. Okay, Dason's guess is a helmet doesn't latch tight. Lauren, what is your guess? I'm thinking, well, I was thinking like, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, like like a Trojan Trojan horse, and then I'm thinking like you know condoms. This is the like Urban Dictionary con- word, brand right? name of condom, right? Oh. So I was thinking it was like when the condom gets like at the top of the penis or something. Oh, that's a good guess. Like a, it, I like it, that And it kind of like rolls out, so it looks has that little swoop. Oh, to it. and the little like spiky helmet. thing on the top. You know, they have that. Right, because the they tip, have that the comb. reservoir tip. The Romans had like, that comb on the top. Yeah. But think about something else about a Roman helmet. They had that part that drops down in front of your oh, nose. Oh, now I know what it is. Oh. oh. Yeah. Oh. oh. Oh dear. Okay, so you've heard of tea bagging, right? I'm not comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> when they're passed out, oh. gently and inconspicuously place your fleshy bag on their forehead oh. while carefully laying down your dude meat down the bridge oh. of their nose in parallel fashion. Here's the uh, the example is Gary passed out, so we all took turns fitting him for a Roman helmet. And I'm sure they took pictures <laughs> and posted them somewhere. Oh. Now the thing is, did he consent to this? Gary was passed out, so I don't think a passed out person can consent. That's Gary. Well, he didn't say no. Well... You're using that version of consent, are you? <laughs> okay. All right. Send your hate mail to Dason at FlamingFreedom.com. We've got to make you that email. Well, account. if you are drinking with a bunch <laughs> of people who would who you think might do that and you and you are going to pass out that you kind of are responsible for it at least i mean certainly you're, you are not consenting but you do have to have full responsibility for that roman helmet uh I okay think. send your hate mail to lauren at flamingfreedom.com <laughs> rape culture <laughs> rape apologist lauren oh that's right you guys are going to respond if you I, join a frat i think uh, you're pretty much consenting to all of this crap though if you're actually like a member of a frat that's one thing i mean because yeah. and you've seen their pictures if you've seen pictures of them doing this to everyone else who ever passes out if you pass out in a frat with that much knowledge not every act so you're some, saying you know, that the or a penis drawn on your cheek yeah that's going to happen so the, bo- the boys that join fl- frats are actually secretly gay and they just want to have like gay stuff happen well, to them, but they're, but they're like yeah. not willing to admit it. Is that what you're saying? Obviously, because I, I think that's what's going on there. I think he's m- you're missing the point. The point is, the point Dell is, is saying is. that fraternities are promoting rape culture, so we need to get rid of them. <laughs> I'm not a fan of frater- fraternities for a number of reasons. I'm not a uh, fan of rape culture. I'm not for I'm a not. number of reasons. Yeah. Mm. 